Hey there, it's me Red Knight and welcome back to Heyday, and it's time for Heyday Styles. Now Heyday Styles is one of the options that Maggie actually gives you within the game when she comes, so let's go and have a look at that in more detail, because I like this option. Now we get two books, there's the style book on the left hand side and the collection book on the right hand side, but the main one we need to focus on is the style book. Now when you actually open up the style book you will see a lot of imagery both for the farmhouse, for the truck and the roadside stall. And each square has a specific design where there are three pieces to be collected. Now as Maggie comes to your farm she will sell you specific parts and if you want to you can buy all three parts. The only problem is those three parts may not match up with a specific style. Now if you would like to get the styles what you need to do is to wait for Maggie to actually bring you the three pieces that you need to complete the style imagery. And then when you do get it you'll actually get gems. So it could be 20 gems, could be 25 gems as an example, but that's going to be the cost or the reward for actually completing one of these designs. And it's the same for both the actual farmhouse, for the truck and the roadside stall. Now let's just say that uh, you did purchase the decorative items of Maggie. Now those items are going to be stored in your sticker book and if you do collect them as an example they will highlight the actual circles down here as well. And if you have actually got one of those pieces in the past, like I actually got the roof for the blue style in the past, the only trouble is because I actually have changed my design that imagery is now missing there. So you can see there there's the actual roof that I purchased originally which I really really did like. The only trouble is I actually then changed it for a second roof down down there. I've also got some different kinds of planks down there as well. Some of them I haven't yet got and some of them I have done. Now if I'd actually kept the roof and tried to get the till planks maybe I could have completed that style much much sooner but that's not to be. So I need to now think about okay what's Maggie going to give me this time and will it affect my actual ability to decorate my house. Well, this is what she gave me. You can see there there's the purple roof, there's the country white, and then there's the guest house. Now both the purple and the country white are not going to be of benefit for me, but the guest house is actually one of those designs. Now if I go back into the style book and I slide on through the designs and I click on each of the circles I can see the name of the specific imagery that I want to look for. Until I actually get to the one that matches what is being given to me. So you can see there, there's the guest house style design, and it's got the guest house porch. That is the one she's given me, but there's no dark straw, and there's no guest house walls. So, I'm going to need both of those two additional pieces to complete this design style. And I've not had them yet, or if I have had them, then I've lost the ability to get them back until they recycle round again. So, uh, I need to think about it. Do I just do the one design or do I restock? Now, we know that restocking gives you the chance to actually get another set of imagery. So, there's the chance that if you do press the restock, it will give you the piece that you do need, but not always. Now, remember, restocks are two, four, and six diamonds. And you'll see here, by restocking, it will give me some new items. And you notice, those are the till panels that could have been used with the blue roof, so I could have done it. Uh, it's a shame I didn't actually keep it. It would have made it a little bit easier, maybe a lot cheaper. So, restocking again, and it's given me red planks this time. So, oh, not so good. But look at the actual vouchers as well. So I do like the red planks. They do change the design very, very nicely. So there are some nice designs there, but it's not what I want. I'm looking for a guest house style imagery. Oh, copper roof. A oh, copy looks really, really nice, by the way. So even though I can't afford it, that is a nice design as well. So I might try and get that one for my big farm. Now what I'm actually looking for here is two more imagery for the guest house and if I can get it I'll be rather happy. Oh sweet! Perfect! Look at that one. Just what I wanted. The dark straw. So, and I do have sufficient coinage as well which is even better. So my guest house style design, I need the dark straw roof there at the first one and then the guest house porch. Now I don't have the walls yet so that's two of the three available with this one design. So if I take both of those 
I don't need to respin, okay, or restock, and I don't even need to choose the sector center design either. So I can save my funding here, because you can still upgrade a building design with only one, or with two, or with all three, or you can totally ignore it. I've got the vouchers, I can do this. So we're going to choose the wall, or sorry, the porch, and we're going to choose the actual roof itself. The walls, mmm, they're beautiful, but no, I don't want them, and I'm going to save my money, I think. Now, I did spend the diamonds, oh, Oh, well, too bad. Uh, I can get those within the game anyway. In fact, most of the diamonds I get from my baby farm, which you're watching at the moment, are in-game diamonds. So I'm not actually spending real cash on this. Not yet, anyway. Level 100 first. So we're choosing those two. I've now collected both of those pieces. So I've got two of the three designs now, which is great. If I come down to my sticker album, I go to my style book and I slide along to that page, you'll see both circles are highlighted. And it means I need one more now. So if I hold off up upgrading each week until that one design comes up, I can complete that actual design there, and I really can't wait to do that one. I just have to be careful now that I don't replace the porch or the roof before I get that central piece. Now it's the same with my truck, and it's the same with my actual roadside shop. Now, in this case, I've already got the Sunnydale style wheels. All I need is the actual back and I need the front as well. Now, this is the offer I've been given. Now, the black hole is one of the actual designs, but the other ones are not. Now, again, I've got a couple of diamonds left here. And what I can do is to actually respin. You never know, I might just get the two pieces I need. So, we're going to do that. We're going to respin the first one, which is. Uh, the, 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 the back of the truck, okay, and that's going to be a nice little bright flat bed there, or light flat bed, and the two-tone one at the front as well, yeah, expensive, 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 so I like the flat bed, I think that one's really, really good, the wheels I'm not going to change, so do I leave them or not, I wonder, I've got no more diamonds left, so I can't really respin the back one, so I guess basically I can't actually do any more of those designs. So even though I like them, I spent a couple of diamonds there to test them to see if I get anything new. I was unlucky. Okay, no worries. Now for my actual roadside shop, if I can get any of these other pieces coming up next time, then I'm going to either go with the pastel style or the rustic style. So I'm going to hold off changing those designs as well, because I do have some pieces already. So guys, you've got a choice. You can start working towards your sticker album, or you can start working towards your style album. Album. Now, for me, I want to do the style album for my baby farm, and I'm going to do the stickers for my big farm. And then maybe at some other stage in the future, I will work on the styles as well. But either way, I hope you've got a rough idea now what you need to do. You need three of the stickers for each of those style designs. Do not change until you've actually collected all of the pieces. Uh, you're going to avoid doing the rest of your album, uh, and I'm afraid it's... A process you're going to have to take into consideration if you want to collect all of those stars first of all. Right, well that's me, Red, signing off. Uh, I'm rather happy with the way that my baby farm is going to go with these three imagery that I'm going to be building up. If you've got any comments or if you've actually done any of your styles already, let me know down below. Uh, send it to me on Facebook or Twitter. I would like to see your styles that have been completed already and I can share them with the rest of the world as well. Uh, Either way, see you next time in my next video. Make sure you hit the like button as usual. Do comment below the video and hit that notification button as well. But either way, I will see you next time. Take care, have fun, and good luck with your style and sticker collection to everybody. Bye-bye.